All right, so here's my prototype Newman motor. And I believe I have it hooked up correctly to charge this battery, which was almost dead. Uh-oh. There it goes. You know, me and prototyping, I, I end up doing way more to the unit than I actually want to do. But it does help me work out the bugs. I think I have it hooked up correctly because this battery, this uh, charging battery was down to like half a volt. Now it's up to six volts. And I actually have the Newman motor running in the opposite direction because I changed the polarity. I think my commutator's messed up. Now I have it running in the opposite direction, not charging any batteries. But my commutator's definitely messed up. So I don't know if I should segment it. or make the segment let's see let me show you so i have it halfway and i have it covering when the um magnets are vertical which seems to be the best way to do it but i don't know if i have too much of the commutator covered Anyway, again, this is a prototype. I literally just threw it together. Ah, oh, that looks cool on the camera. Anyway. All right. I think I've got it hooked up correctly now because the, the charge battery is starting to charge up up to 8 volts and it was literally down to nothing and it's pretty stable famous last words again what I was saying about prototyping I end up doing way too much detailed work for a prototype Let's see what the battery's up to. So the battery's... Oops. Sorry, guys. So the battery's been charged up. It's starting to drop now. So when you charge up a battery like this, it goes up high and then drops down to its... the, the actual charge. So I'm not sure what it's going to drop down to. Damn. All right. Anyway, there's the prototype. Nice. I had to put screws in there because battery the uh, ma the magnets were flying out. All right. Cool. Yeah. So it was the commutator. Because as soon as I took, uh, where is it, this guy off, oh, that's not it. But you know what I mean, it was one of these, one, one of these little uh, pallets. Once I took that off and just put a piece of tape on the shaft, it's taken off. And it's running a lot smoother. Yeah, yeah, this was the thing that I used. And I really thought that, this would make it, this would look nicer and it would run better. But it's not. I mean, you can hear it's running so much better. And it's giving a, um, a pretty steady charge to the charge battery. 
So I'm going to let it run like this for a while and see, see what kind of charge I get on that battery. Got this stupid phone on a stand. It's running nice now. Running really nice now. That's what I get for trying to make it pretty. All right, ciao.